Lake Victoria had dried up. Lake Victoria had dried up. Yeah? There are rivers which are drying up every day because of silting. In, in my place there in Kapchora, rivers are, you, you, the rivers have turned brown because the soil finds its way into the water because everywhere has been, there are no trees that are cultivated everywhere. So we need to wake up. We shall have a very serious disaster in this country. We need to protect our wetlands. We need to get away from the river banks. We need to get away from the, 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 the lake shores. Now, some people think that because they have the money, they, they can go and build in the lake. Some of their properties are found that way in the lake. Even the land titles they were bragging about are now in the lake. I don't know how they are going to. So, yeah, Lake Victoria water is actually polluted. Again, we are talking about plastics. We are getting waste water that is not treated, discharged into the lake. That's why we are having the lake water not being of good quality. So, for you to, uh, to use that water for drinking, it has to be treated. And right now, National Water is spending a lot of money about three times the amount of money they were spending about five years ago. So that's why we want to address these challenges, for example, of plastic pollution, so that the quality of our water can remain. But in many parts of the country where there has not been any degradation, this water is okay. This is the water people are drinking from gravity flow schemes from springs. But the concern is that the quality is deteriorating because of the degradation of the environment, and also uh, discharge of untreated wastewater. And that's why we want to take action.